Hello, today I'm talking heavy metal. Cut. just gone and bought some panniers and in this video I'm going to fit them to the bike, go for a ride and give you my first impressions. Welcome to Operation Pannier. What's in the box? Panniers themselves are a package, the locks and the keys. All of this is the mounting kit, the two sides of the pannier and all the mounting equipment and the bolts. And that's about it. Let's get on with it. Okay the first thing we need to do is fit this plate so that it comes up and fits in here and that needs to go under there, which you probably can't see, but I need to cut holes under there for it. So next we need to put these little brackets underneath here. So we've got mounting point, which is there and comes down here. And then mounting point here, which you probably can't see very well. And mounting point on that side. It's been about an hour. about halfway through or maybe not even halfway through this has proven to be a bit more of a uh, pain and I think the reason is the bike is so old I've crashed quite a lot and I think some of the frame and pillion foot pegs here you can see they're supposed to line up and they're not doing some of that is that squashing quite heavily against the exhaust can there um, and that side so this frame is going and it's going to work and it will work nicely but it's um, proving a challenge okay all these bolts are in now so these had to be slightly reshaped because a lot of this is pushed out of kilter and out of shape. So that mounting point, those mounting points at the back there, and that one under there, and those five have been a real pig. But we're there now, and I think we'll leave it there for tonight. Okay, it's a new day and we're having another go, putting the pannier racks on. We've got one side on. Right, so now we've got to do this side. We're going pretty much like that. We need to take the foot peg connector out and that has a bolt that goes through there. That part 
connects under there, and that part connects up there. Should be a bit easier than to the side. I'm up in the forest of Poland today and I'm testing out the new panniers for the first time. I didn't film the end on the last video of putting them together, largely because where that bolt is, <clears throat> it took me about four hours just to get the pin out of there. These inner bags here I got off eBay, they're about half the price of the standard GV bags. Fit perfectly, designed for this, these panniers. So a 30 second summary. On the plus side, the panniers are great quality and comparative good value for money. There's a large range of available racks, which means you can reuse them on other bikes. The rack fitment is well designed and simple, but could be complicated on older, well used bikes. Matched locks, including a spare barrel and key for a top box, means you can manage a full set of luggage from a single key. On the downside, the overall width of the bike is increased. I experience speed wobbles, particularly in windy conditions and over 70 mile an hour. They do add a fair bit of weight to an already heavy bike. They're not fully waterproof. I brought some aftermarket inner bags from Great Bikers Gear on eBay. If you've got this far, why not consider subscribing to the channel? Thanks for watching. See you again soon.